Hey, what's up? Today's the second video of my eight part video series where I'm teaching you how to get your website and business ready for the new year. Hey there, my name is Brad Smith, owner and founder of healthlinks.com. It's my mission and my passion to help others with their business. So if I can be your coach, your mentor, or help you in any way, that's my goal. My goal is to bring you value. So let me know if there's anything I can help you with and I look forward to working with you. Can you believe it's only six weeks away until the new year? Are you ready? Are you prepared? I've been hearing from some of our current customers that they're ready. They've been working hard all year, so by 2018, they're ready. They're ready to get new customers. In the first video, we talked about relationships and why I thought it was the most beneficial thing for your business, building your overall brand and growing your website. How can you build a relationship with somebody that visits your website, just like you would when you shake someone's hand? So if you haven't watched that, please go back and check that out. That's what I think is the most important. The second most important is keywords and the words that people are going to be searching for when looking for your business where you're going to show up when somebody's looking for your specialty or what you offer now we might have our own thing in our head okay private personal trainer or local chiropractor but what is it that the customers are looking for that's what you want to make sure you're focused on those three to four to maybe even five keywords that you offer need to be exactly what the customer is going to go to Google and search for or YouTube and search for. So that's why I made that most important. Get in their mindset. Um, try to think of as a customer what you would search for if you were the customer. Next, what you love. When you're focusing your business, whether it's your blogs, your website, what you offer into those three to four keywords, make it about what you love, what you're passionate about because you're the one that's going to have to make content about it. You're going to have to write the blogs, make the videos, make new pages on the website. Uh, talk to customers about what you love. So make those keywords about what you're, what motivates you and what you like working with clients with. What brings you money? So obviously you don't want to have something that you know hardly costs anything. That's what you're focused around your keywords on. What's going to bring you the most money? What are the most people going to be searching for from what you love about what you love and then the most revenue for your business? So maybe you love doing one-on-one -on -one personal training clients. So you need to focus on personal training and your location. Those are three good words. That's what you love. That's what's going to bring you the most money. And that's what clients are going to be searching for on Google. What if you have a chiropractic office, you have all these different services, but what is it that you specialize in? You might be the chiropractor. That's what you specialize in. You might, that might bring the most money to your business. So chiropractor, local, and your location. Those are just some simple tips that you could use. I want you to leave me a comment below if you need any help with this, if you need any help figuring out what the two to three to four keywords are to focus your website and focus your business about. It's really hard to get ranked and start showing up if you focus on every single different service you offer. So if you offer spin classes, group training, and personal training, three different things, focus on what's going to bring you the most money, what you love, and then once you get that, where you're getting tons of new customers and a lot of new leads from your website, then you can move on to the second one. You have the chiropractic office you have massage acupuncture um, all these different services focus on chiropractic first and then work your way down the line on what's going to bring the most value the most revenue and what you love doing if this helped you in any way please share it with someone you know would love if you subscribe so you've got the third fourth and all the way to the eighth video and leave me a comment if you need help with your keywords i'll see you guys next week